Shalom, Brother Kabbalah, back with my GMS lesson, GMS keep pushing. For going any further, I give all praise, honor, and glory to the heavenly Father's only begotten Son, Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashem, Rekakwadash, the honors to our apostles and elders of Great Millstone for teaching us this truth, according to the Bible, we will. Another Shalom, the all the sincere Akims, for the four corners of the earth, pushing this truth through diligence and sincerity. All right, found this article in the AJC. All right, Atlanta News Now. Um, it says health experts urge confidence in Maxine after superstar's death. All right, it says when Hank Aaron and other African American leaders invited reporters to watch them receive the uh, Crown Royal immunizations jabs on January 5th the baseball legend said he did so to help spread the word to millions that the Maxine is safe it felt good Aaron said now for those who don't know Aaron <coughs> as we just read um, he was a baseball legend I, I, I remember this guy um, I mean he was before way before my time but you know I remember uh, hearing about you know Hank Aaron and all the records and you know the uh, you know things he had to go through facing being um, you know a so-called Negro baseball player in the time that he was playing okay um, but anyway it says it felt good Aaron said afterwards the Morehouse School of, of Medicine where the event was held now just over two weeks later Public health experts and some of the black leaders with Aaron that day worried that an event that drew so much public publicity could inadvert inadvertently serve to undermine confidence in Maxine. Within minutes of news breaking Friday morning of the group baseball greats' death, those who doubt about the Maxine turned to social media trying to draw a connection to Aaron's recent immunization. Okay. So two weeks later, two weeks later, you know, this Jake uh, passes away, man. All right. Passes away. It says that worries Joe Beasley, one of the activists who re received the the M uh, Maxine shot alongside Aaron. I hope this will this won't be having a chilling effect on our people," said Beasley, 84 years old. We can't afford it because too many people are dying from Crown Royal. A cause of death was not announced, but the brave said Aaron died peacefully in his sleep. Okay. And that's him getting the shot, getting the jab. Slocky getting the jab. Oh, man. Once again, you know, this topic arrives, man. Um, this topic arrives, man. This, 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 this guy... Sleazy, sleazy has never had your best interest, man. Never had your best interest, man. This is uh, Sirach 12 and 10. Never trust thy enemy. For like as iron rusteth, so is his wickedness. Oh, we got to make sure we take care of the black and Latino people. You know, finally take a stand. They need to be the first ones. To get the jab, to get the Maxine, to get the Crown Royal. Never trust thy enemy. Just like his iron rusts on metal, his wickedness is going to eventually come back and show. He's going to show his horns, and he's showing his horns now to our people, man. Though he humbled himself, verse 11. And go crouching, yet take good heed of him, and beware of him, and thou shalt be unto him as, as though thou hast wiped a looking glass, and thou shalt know that his rust hath not been altogether wiped, wiped away. 
That's right, man. Keep your eyes on this devil, man. Because you know, at the end, at the end of the day, he's going to eventually show his wickedness, man. He's going to show them teeth, man. He, he, you know, he, eventually, he's going to try to bite you. Okay? So, if, if we're not supposed to trust and, and, and sleazy eat, who are we supposed to trust in? Right? I mean, there's plenty of scriptures. Matter of fact, let's see here. Let's go to uh, let's go to um, read this from Psalm seven and one. It says, "Sagan of David, which he sang unto the Lord concerning the words of Cush, the Benjamite. O Lord." my power and thee do I put my trust so we put our trust in the heavenly father man there was only begotten son Yahweh Shai all right with the world and he calls Jesus Yahweh Shai which means he delivered he saves in the Hebrew all right that's what we probably putting our trust in man it says save me from all them that persecute me and who's on that head list of persecuting you Israelites man you so-called Negro Latino Native Americans Esau Edom okay it says and deliver me because we're going to definitely need deliverance from the hands of this devil, man. Because he's looking to take us all out. Man, woman, and child, the Israelites. He's looking to take us all out, man. Okay? After the crown royal, that's one of the ways he's going to try to take our people out. Psalms 9 and 10. And they that know thy name will put their trust in thee. That's why the name is so important, Nate. Okay? From the IUIC, that's why the name is very important, man. Trust goes back to a firm belief, confidence in someone or something, and that's your how about me out shot. The scripture says, and they that know thy name will put their trust in thee. You can't put your, your trust in the big man upstairs. You can't put your trust in Jesus Christ that's been failing our people. For the Lord hath not forsaken them that seek thee. That's right, man. Read Ecclesiastes, the second chapter, man. Around the 10th verse. So let's grab me one more and wrap it on up, man. So it's Psalms 27. Some trust in chariots, some trust some in horses. But we will remember the name of the Lord our power. That's right, man. Because, you know, everybody sees how great, you know, America is and how strong America is. And they trust in that, man. They trust in this man's system. Right, they trust in his power, but it literally they know that this power was given to them by the Most High. And we know, sort of, had apostles and elders of Great Millstone on down. We know that the Lord is stripping this man of his power, man, and it's been a change of power. That's why you see, matter of fact, let's get that. That's why you see this devil coming down. <clears throat> it's Revelation 12 and 12. Therefore rejoice ye heavens and ye that dwell in them. Woe to the inhabitants of the earth and of the sea. For the devil has come down unto you having great wrath. Because he knoweth that he have but a short time. A short time of what? Ruling. That's why he's coming down with these Maxines. The jab. Alright. This crown royal. To do away with you you Israelites. Because he knows his time of ruling is short. So he's going to try to take you out. So stop trusting this man. Stop trusting this man. Okay? Giving all praise, honor, and glory to the Heavenly Father's only God, Son, Yahweh, Ba'ashim, Yahweh, Shai, Ba'ashim, Rakakwadash, the bonus of apostles and elders of Great Millstone for teaching us this truth according to the Bible and we will. I know Shalom, Lord, the sincere acting, so the four corners of the earth pushing this truth through diligence and sincerity. Shalom.